Of course, Towski Valley is already a world renowned resort, but they're attracting even more attention after achieving a first for any resort anywhere in North America. Jonathan Field shares how this milestone could perhaps ensure the resort's ongoing survival. Quite frankly, you got to start somewhere, and if we don't support this technology, it's not going to advance. In recent years, Towski Valley has made strides toward the future. In 2021, they became a carbon neutral company. I just hope other ski resorts start to catch on to what we're doing here, um, reducing our carbon footprint. If we want to protect our winners, this is our, our first step. Since then, they have transformed their lineup to include more electric vehicles, like snowmobiles. We purchased nine of those this year, and we're looking at purchasing more for next year, you know, after testing them this this winter. Um, they've really worked out well for us. We did purchase a, a hybrid snowcat as well this year. And this is a, a, a snowcat that runs on diesel and it also runs on electric. We're saving, you know, 1,500 to 1,800 gallons of diesel just on that one machine alone. The electric snowcat is another step in that direction. With a battery life of around three hours, it's gotten some special use. We use it for cleaning out underneath all of our lifts. We get into some of the tight areas to clean out after snowstorms with it. Um, we also use it for our Bavarian sleigh ride, our dinner sleigh rides. Seminars on the Snowcat have even attracted attention from resorts in Canada and Italy. With all the attention on Tau Ski Valley, some may wonder what's next. I can't ever see our owner selling. He has invested too much and loves this place too much. This is, this is a gem, you know, and as all of us locals here in Taos know, it is a gem. It's, uh, it's something that I think will be around and will be independently owned. Jonathan Field, KOB4.